Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is another request, so thank you very much for requesting me to do a video. Um, and it is the loom band request. So I'm going to show you how to make one of these fishtail looms. So this one is yellow and what's the other colour? White, that's the one. And they're like little Vs. I'm really sorry my camera doesn't focus I'm getting a new one for Christmas which is coming up as you will all be aware so fingers crossed everything will be much better when my new fancy camera comes um, so yeah I'm gonna show you how to make that so my first step is I have organized some looms into colors because it just makes your life so much easier especially if you know you're wanting to do a pattern so I think I'm going to do this yellow and this greeny colour for my loom band today so you need obviously some looms and you need your hands and the one of these little S clip things to clip it together the first thing you're going to want to do is decide which fingers you're going to use you're going to use these two or these two I'm left handed so I'm going to use put the looms on this one so you take one twist it so it's like a number eight and then you just put it on them two fingers like that so the cross is in the middle then your other color pop that on top so I'm gonna go green yellow green yellow and then you put the yellow on top so you oh, the rule for this one is you always need like three always you take the bottom one pop it pop it done Yellow's on the top, Ooh, so we need a green. Three again, one, two, three. Green over, because it's on the bottom, over. And I'm gonna move it down, because it tends to work its way up, it seems. Green's on the top, so that means I need a yellow. You do lose track. And also, you can hurt your fingers sometimes. So sometimes, I've seen people use like two pens stood up, just like your fingers would be. So yellow, over, because it's on the bottom, and over, and already we're starting to get our pattern. Yellow's on the top, so green it needs to be. Ooh. Blimey, I can't do it. That's it, over. And sometimes, in, if you buy a set, you get these like little plastic hook things, which sometimes are quite handy just to dig in and flip over the top. So already, as you can see there you're starting to get it and for your S clip all you do is hook it on literally like that hook it in because it's got a little ooh, there that's better a little hook so you just pop the rubber band into that whole part and it's, it connects to it so next up greens on top so that means I need a yellow so you go over and over and you just basically keep doing that until it's all done and already it is growing as you can see is these colors are there some off of Harry Potter these colors I feel like they remind me of something off of Harry Potter I might call this the Harry Potter loom which sounds like something off of the film anyway the loom of Harry Potter I've never well I can't get into Harry Potter films I've got to admit I think they are an amazingly made. I think JK Rowling is an amazing writer. The actors are brilliant, the stories are great, and all that sort of stuff. But honestly, I just can't even get into it. It is not my cup of tea at all. I've tried and I sit there, but just nothing happens to me. I don't get excited, I don't enjoy it, I just ugh, I just don't like it. And it's summer that I really wish could like so me saying that these yellow and green loom bands are reminding me of something off of Harry Potter I might be talking complete nonsense and I've got that all wrong but I'm sure you'll let me know in the comments if I'm just completely wrong with it so basically that is it so it just keeps growing put one on flip the bottom one that one's got a bit tight again there use my little hook and bring it down so when you get to this point I'm not going to make it any longer but obviously you need to make it as long as you want it whether it's a ring, a bracelet, a necklace, an anklet, a bookmark or just anything whatever length you want it to be so you take the bottom one off you take the other bottom one off and then the two yellows that are left well whatever colour you will have left just bring together 
and then slip them on the other end on that S clip and then let go and then oh do you know what I've made myself a Harry Potter ring <laughs> that is what it's going to be this bloom do you know it doesn't look too bad does it let's have a look oh hey hey nice sock <laughs> there we go so I've made a Harry Potter loom ring so if you guys liked this video give it a thumbs up and if you're going to try it yourself let me know tweet me here or message me in the comments below i love reading and trying to connect with you and talking to you and all that sort of stuff and generally i reply to every single comment that i get as well so i will see you next time bye